In the excitement of the farmer's market, our Antifo has the story of one vendor whose passion makes the day a little brighter. On a chilly, cloudy afternoon, students line up to bring a little spring color into their rooms. Wait, I like this one better, right? yeah, yeah. Flowers. Purple, orange, pink, and green flowers being bought at the Elon Farmer's Market by the Elon community, and specifically, many Elon University students. One of these students, yeah. Evelyn Ely, brought her flowers to replace the ones she had previously. I keep my flowers beside my bed, so every morning when I wake up, it's the first thing I see, and it's just a nice little taste of spring. Broadwell Root sells flowers by the bouquet. They have been selling at the farmer's market since 2019. Co-owner Clark Norman grows the flowers alongside his wife, Tammy. He says people flock to the flowers. I, I think just whenever the... The tent is full, it just attracts people. It's, it's, it's almost like a pollinator garden. It, people just come. And attract people is exactly what Norman's tent did. After an hour and a half, three bouquets were left. A 4.30 restock brought new life to the booth, which, once again, merely sold out in 45 minutes. I'm a small town in South Carolina, and we do farmer's markets like this all the time at home. Okay. So it just kind of gives me a taste of home, and I love supporting local businesses. The sun did end up coming out that first farmer's market of the year. And for student Anna Mattawarren, the sun wasn't the only thing that brightened her day. A little small piece of spring that you can bring into your house, and it's always nice to have them um, in my kitchen, in my apartment. It's just a little, little nice way to brighten my day at home. Brightening days, of course, is just what Clark Norman's intentions are. Flowers just bring joy to people. And on a college campus, you see it very quickly. Annie Tifo, Elon, Local News. The next time you go to the farmer's market, be sure to stop by Rodwell Roots.